If you've fallen out of love with your kitchen, this week on Check It Out Milton, we're gonna show you how you can adore your kitchen again. Hi, I'm Shalini Riquez. I'm a Remax real estate agent living and working in Milton, and I love sharing the things that I love about Milton with all of you. This week on Check It Out Milton, we are checking out Adore Your Kitchen. They are a Milton kitchen refacing company that does amazing work. You are going to want to check this out because this is an incredible transformation. Hey, show me. Hi, Welcome. how are you? Come on in. Come on in. All right. Thank you Welcome. so much. Welcome to this beautiful home in the heart of Milton. Uh, we've got an exciting project uh, lined up here. Follow me. Okay. So this is the state of the kitchen as it exists at the moment. Oh, wow. The homeowner just bought this uh, property uh, a couple of months ago and has been actively renovating it and bringing it right up to uh, scratch. Um, the kitchen is one of the last things that they've got to get done. Um, and they reached out to us um, and uh, we, we met with them a couple of weeks ago. We went through all the options and finally uh, we decided that a light gray color would suit this uh, kitchen the best. So we're going to be, um, in the next couple of days, we're going to be taking out all the old doors, putting brand new shaker style light gray doors. We're going to be paneling up all the exterior of the kitchen. So wherever you look at this kitchen, it's going to be brand new. Okay. Um, the owner's really excited. He's uh, been great. Uh, you know, it's great that you come in early before our crew gets here because once they get here, it's going to be pretty noisy. So if you turn around this way and you see the island here, this island actually existed as part of the original kitchen. It, um, it started from here and it went out as a diagonal peninsula and uh, really didn't serve any purpose. So we thought of repurposing some of these cabinets instead of just throwing them uh, in, you know, in the landfill. So we cut this out and made it into an island. Um, over the next couple of days, we're gonna finish paneling the island, put new doors on, and then finally new countertops and a new backsplash. So at the end of the day, it's gonna look like a brand new kitchen and our homeowner is so excited. Can't wait to see the results. Awesome, I can't wait to see the results too. <laughs> Looking forward to it. Okay. Come on in, Shalini. Wow, this is incredible. I can't even believe the difference here. This island is awesome. The colors of the kitchen, like the kitchen cabinetry colors are incredible. You really did an amazing job, Jim. This is so awesome. Thank you. I can't even believe it's the same kitchen. <laughs> what a it difference. Is. I love these shaker style cabinets. I just love the color. It's like a very soft dove gray. Do you remember what this color was called? Yes, it was dove gray. Was it dove Absolutely. gray? Absolutely. Oh, okay, yeah. It is just gorgeous. Really, really amazing. The backsplash, the quartz counters. It, this, this, it's almost like you pulled the the color from the quartz cabinet, like right into the, uh, right into the cabinetry. The quartz counters, amazing. Yeah. So tell me a little bit about what you ended up doing in here. So as as you could see, the client had brown doors, and he really wanted to go with gray, a light gray. We found him the exact color that the designer had actually asked him to get. Okay. Um, so if you look around here, you see this really light gray uh, shaker style door, which is really modern, and um, and we went with a subway tile and uh, quartz countertops. Um, he just got all the finishes that he wanted yeah. and uh, he is really thrilled about it. It is, it, it looks incredible. Like I just, I was blown away when I walked through. Uh, it looks just, looks completely different. Totally changed the look of the kitchen. You did an amazing job. Thank you. 
So painting your cabinets mainly uh, involves spraying the existing doors. We're not really adding anything new to the kitchen. We can change the layout of the kitchen. With refacing, you can also change the layout of your kitchen. A lot of times people are um, confused. They say, well, is it gonna be the same kitchen? Can I add anything? Can I change some things? I need to put a bigger fridge in. I need to put a bigger stove in. We can make all those changes happen. We can add islands, we can add pantries, um, we can reshape uh, certain cabinets and resize them as well. We can remove microwave boxes and convert them into full cabinets. Basically, we can take all the steps that are required to make your outdated kitchen look brand new. Besides refacing, what other services do you provide? So besides refacing, we can change your countertops, we can retile your backsplash, and if a customer wants a complete new kitchen, we can gut the existing kitchen and start from scratch. How long does the process take of refacing the kitchen? So generally, we are booking out between one and a half to two months ahead, okay. but we sometimes have a, a little break between jobs. Maybe the client is looking to change floors, uh, maybe they've had a change in schedule, and we may have an opening. So I always ask clients to uh, call me and ask me directly if they have an urgent uh, project that needs to be done and we can move sometimes as fast as one and a half weeks from the time of signing up a client to the time the, the job is actually completed. Oh wow, that's fast. Yes. That's awesome. Less downtime, like when you're like, right? And, and chaos in your house and sort of waiting Absolutely. for that transition, right? And, and it helps so much when a client is looking to sell and their real estate agent is um, has approached me and said that we need this done yesterday because yes. the house is not selling. So we come in sometimes and we've, uh, the quickest we've ever done is four days, pretty much four days from the time we've signed up the client. We started the job um, and on the fifth day, we finished the job and uh, basically the photographer was coming in to take pictures and we were leaving at that point. So we are able to react really fast sometimes when we do have that gap in our schedule. Amazing. Uh, well, the process was really interesting, um, kind of helping with Jim, helping me go through start from start to finish, um, all the way from looking at what we had before and then kind of the vision that I wanted. Uh, Jim was very helpful with incorporating some new ideas uh, to the project and um, just completely blew away my expectations of, of what I could picture this, this kitchen having. Uh, he was very helpful with working with uh, other folks that were involved with the project and his, his men were amazing. They were on time, they were, they were um, very, very cordial. The, the work, I think, speaks for itself. So I'm extremely satisfied. So Jim, if people want to learn a little bit more about Adore Your Kitchen, how could they do that? They can go on adoreyourkitchen.ca and learn more about us and contact us from there. Um, we are also on Homestars. So we've been there for uh, a good four years. Um, we have over 60 reviews and we have a 9.9 .9 out of 10 rating. Uh, we are also recently Bomber approved. Okay, amazing. All right, well, thank you so much for watching, everyone. I hope that you enjoyed this episode and we'll see you next week, Milton.